everybody, it's Kelsey. Welcome back to the channel. So let's just get into this. This is all natural lighting, so if it changes, oh well. I didn't feel like setting up my light stuff, so. Oh, the first time I smoked weed was my freshman year of high school. Um, during like my seventh and eighth grade year of um, middle school, my sister started to smoke weed. She's uh, five years older than me. She, at least I was aware that she started to smoke weed and um, it was just kind of always this like unspoken, just kind of like weed isn't a bad thing, kind of, but like it wasn't like in my face growing up because not at all. My sister, it was kind of like this unspoken thing between my mom and my sister and me that like my mom gave my sister consent to like educate me or maybe my sister just educated me just because, but like she just nonchalantly, like I remember very vividly that she wasn't allowed to smoke in the house. So she always had to go outside in the garage. So like, she always like either hide her bong in like a really big jacket that she was wearing or like hide her bowl or her joint in like her pocket or something. It was kind of obvious when they were, when her and her boyfriend, fiance, um, now, <laughs> uh, that's crazy. They've been together for so long. Um, but yeah, um, I remember him like hiding it and like trying to just sneak off to the bedroom, which is actually what this room was, their bedroom. Um, I'm like really giving you guys some personal information. <laughs> um, but yeah, I remember one day she was just like, um, nonchalantly just like, hey, you have you ever heard of dabs? And I was just like, um, I mean, I've heard people like say it in middle school because like, it wasn't a thing that like there were stoners in middle school, at least what I was aware of. Um, but I know people who smoke weed in middle school, like looking back on it. For some reason I just like heard it or whatever. And well, because I was also kind of interested in smoking weed. Um, I forget how I was like first fully introduced to it. Um, but whatever. Um, and she was just like, well, I don't want you to be miseducated and get like some bad stuff. So I'm gonna educate you on this. And she told me about like how like the really dark tarry looking stuff isn't good for you and it's full of chemicals and blah, 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 blah. And how like more of like the honey looking ones are a lot better. Anyway, and she was just educating me on it. And, and it wasn't like a, oh man, look at this, all this weed I have. You know, it was just like, just a very, just like, hey, I'm just informing you, so like, when you start smoking, cause I know you're gonna start smoking. Um, cause actually they said, my family did say that they wanted the first time I smoked to be with them, but me being a stupid teenager, I didn't, um, which we're about to get to that. Anyway, what was he saying? So yeah, it was just a very straight, to the point education of weed every once in a while i did sorry if i like really touch my eyes um i'm supposed to wear glasses and it hurts after a while of not wearing glasses oh my god that feels so much better holy shit like my eyes strain super super hard to see when i don't have them on but i don't like filming with them on but i just put my makeup on so i haven't had these on for like a good half hour 45 minutes so like my eyes are like oh my god we need to see correctly um so sorry if there's gonna be a glare of because i do have like a lamp in my room that's on um so i'm gonna have to like look like this so it doesn't glare um so yeah if, if there and, and there's a window right there so like this is why i don't like wearing my glasses but we're gonna finish this story because i'm dedicated and my eyes hurt well not anymore because i got my glasses on um but it was painful there for a second my first time smoking weed it was like i think it was 15 when i smoked because my birthday's in november so um, it was like warmer. It was like spring when I smoked. So I was 15 and uh, I, I was hanging out with these kids who smoked weed um, and they were just super chill and down to earth, whatever. Um, just like me. And, but minus the stoner part, uh, just yet. And, and so I really started to crush on this guy. And I was like, you cute, you smoke weed you're gonna be the first person I smoke with. And I did. <laughs> and it happened. And 
I didn't address it like that at all, obviously. Um, but I remember one day we snuck out during last period of school. So there's like this little patch of woods, neighborhood, and then woods. Um, if that makes sense. Uh, so we like walked through the neighborhood during seventh period into these woods, just like a couple feet into the woods, just enough so like people couldn't see us or smell it. And you know what? I really forget what we smoked out of. I want to say it was an apple because we smoked out of apples so much during high school before school, uh, which is really bad. Don't do that. Okay. If you're in high school and you're watching this, um, you really should not do that. That is a bad, bad, bad idea. In hindsight, not smart, but we did all the time. And we'd use apples cause they were easy to just like, you know, take a couple bites out of it, obviously like bite and then spit out the bad parts with all the ashy stuff. And then just take, and then it just looks like an apple was eaten and thrown into the woods. Oh my gosh, I should not be educating any of you on this, okay? If you're a kid, if you're an adult, do what you want. And then as we were like walking back, because we like timed it perfectly to where when we'd walk back, we just had to get right on the bus and get home. So as we were walking back, we like, well one, we like turned the wrong corner and then had to like go back. And I remember on our way back, well, I had like my book bag on me and you know, like my tennis shoes and whatever. And I was just like, man, and it was like really nice out and I was just high as fuck. And oh God, that's like the best high. Do you ever just miss your first high? Like, damn, I got baked. <laughs> and well, that's not the first time I've been like the peak of highness. I will tell that story maybe another time. Um, <laughs> that was, that'll be a short story. Oh my. As we were walking back, I was like holding my book bag straps and I was just looking at the ground and the sky and whatever. And then I looked over at him and I was just like, you know, it's just so nice out. I just feel like it, it just feels like we're hiking. And, and he looks over at me and he's just like, how high are you? He was like, or something like you're really high or something like that. And I was just like, I think so. <laughs> And I don't know, I just, he, and then I just remember us laughing. And then I remember as we walked back, I like, I must have swallowed the smoke because I like, I remember I burped and like a little bit of smoke came out and I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> um, but anyway, that was my first time smoking and I really don't remember after that. Obviously I got on the bus and made it home and probably ate and slept. Um... But yeah, and then, oh man, this is bringing up so many other stories. So comment down below if you want to hear the story of my first, like my extreme peak of highness. And the second story of the first time my mom found out I smoked weed. That was a crazy story. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I hope that you have a wonderful morning, day, or night. Um, stay high, my friends. Bye.